Hello! In this video, we are going to prove the following theorem. Suppose F is a non-empty family of sets, and B is a set. If B is a subset of every set in F, then B is a subset of the intersection of F. Now, if we recall, given a family of sets F, to say that X is an element of the intersection of F means that X is an element of every set in F. Okay, now let's get into proving this theorem. Now really, we're trying to prove if this is true, then this is true. So let's suppose that this is true. Our whole goal now is to show that everything in B also lies in the intersection of F. So give me an arbitrary element of B. I'll call it X. Now we want to show that X lies in the intersection of f. What that means is, is we want to show x is an element of every set in f. More precisely, to prove that x is an element of every set in f, we're really trying to show that for all sets a in f, x is an element of a. So give me an arbitrary set in f. I'll call it a. We want to show that x lies in a. Now since b is a subset of every set in f, well then, in particular, B must be a subset of A. And since X is an element of B and B is a subset of A, it follows that X is an element of A. So putting this together, we see that under the assumption that A is an element of F, it follows that X is an element of A. Since A was an arbitrary set in F, this means that for all sets A and F, X is an element of A. In other words, we've shown that X is an element of every set in F. So, X is an element of the intersection of F. So now, putting this all together, we assume that X is an element of B, and from there it followed that X is an element of the intersection of F. Since X was arbitrary, this means every element in B also lies in the intersection of F. And that is exactly what we wanted to prove. So this completes the proof. And so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video.